Shit! Cotter, I need all your strength. We need to get to that village. Help us! Do something! Ivies. Wait. No. Garrett, tell them. You're making a mistake. I've come from House Forester in search of the North Grove. this kind of behavior among my handmaidens. One of you must answer for this. What were you thinking? <laughs> my lady, please. See. She Yes, I will. in, but you... Please, Lady Marjorie. Please don't send me back to Highgard. Finally, you grace us with your presence. I was beginning to think you'd found someone else to serve. Sorry if I kept you waiting. I came as quickly as I could, my lady. I'll get to you in a moment. Do you realize how precarious my position is with Cersei? Of course, my lady. Of all the people in King's Landing, you steal from the Queen Regent. I didn't mean... Did you know about this? Sarah's been stealing wine. From Cersei. No less. As if I haven't got enough to worry about. I'll take that as a yes. If you wanted wine, you should have just asked. God's the pair of you. I'm sorry. I shouldn't get so flustered. It's just... I need order in my household. Until I'm married to Tommen, I can't afford any more mistakes. I have no choice but to make changes among my handmaidens. Tommen's garden party, Mira. What were you thinking? I can't believe you'd be so irresponsible. But, uh, Lady Marjorie, I don't know what you mean. Oh, I must have it wrong. It must have been some other handmaiden making a scene with Lord Andros. Sarah's been saying some damning things about you, Mira. I suspect in an effort to save her own neck. My lady, please! You've said enough. One of you must answer for this. Sarah says you used her to get you into the party. 
You've been with me a long time, Mira. When I'm queen, I'll need people I can count on. Please, tell me this isn't true. Please, Mira. I don't deserve to lose my position for this. Sneaking me into the party was Sarah's idea. You liar! Lady Marjorie, please! Let her speak. She forced me to come with her. Mira! How could you? I trusted you! And you betrayed me! Nothing? You are a coward, Mira Forrester. A coward and a traitor! You deceitful, treacherous... One day, all of this will catch up to you, Mira. You'll end up with a knife in your back or your head on a spike. And when that day comes, I'll pray to the Seven for your soul. That's enough, Sarah. Consider yourself dismissed from my service. But my lady... I said enough. Get out of my sight before you make things worse. Oh, such a sweet girl when she came to us. Why would she lie to me like that? Why would she betray my trust? Since the day she arrived, she's been angling to get closer to you, to take my place. Sarah may put on a sweet face, but she's as ambitious as anyone in King's Landing. I saw that too. I just didn't want to believe it. For all the trouble you've brought, I'm glad you came to me. I think of you as more than just my handmaiden. You're a friend. An ally, even. You honor me, Lady Marjorie. But I'm merely your humble servant. We both know that isn't true. I have to distance myself from you for a time. What? Why? There are rumors circulating. Stupid lies about you and a murdered Lannister guard. But stupid lies can be dangerous. I can't be associated with this, or with you, until you put it to rest. I hope you understand. When I'm queen, I can help you again. Maybe we can help each other. Until then, be careful, Mira. And goodbye. <laughs>